Hey yogis, I got a story for you. If you're a scuba diver, you're probably gonna wanna listen to this story. If you are a person who likes uh, stories about winning, you might wanna listen to this story. It's a longer story though, so I'll try and get it out to you as fast as I can. Basically, uh, about 15 years ago, I bought a $1,500 plus dollar amazing wristwatch scuba dive computer. And after about eight years later, it needed batteries. So under the Batteries for Life warranty, I sent it back to Switzerland. A month later, they, I get a call back. Oh, we finally got to your computer, and sorry, we don't work on those anymore. We don't put batteries in them anymore. I'm like, what do you mean you don't put batteries anymore? Well, long story short, we go round and round, round and round. I talk to the manager at the shop. Sorry, you know, that model's out of, t they don't even stock that model anymore. Sorry, that's the deal. I'm like, but I sent you a working model. It said guarantee, blah, blah, blah. Well, long story short, they convinced me into buying a uh, upper model for the cost of factory, which was about $750. So instead of free batteries when it shipped it in, 750 bucks later, I've got a new computer, right? Five years later, the exact freaking thing happens. I come back from diving in Mexico, I got a low battery warning, and I send it into the dive shop, they send it to, the, to Scuba Pro, and, um, and I get the same call a month later, sorry, we don't have that model anymore, we're not putting batteries in them anymore, you're gonna have to upgrade, and I am freaking pissed off. I call the owner of the dive shop, Talk to him, he says, hey, I got your back, I'm gonna go to bat for you. Uh, he goes round and round with the company and comes back and says, hey, I'm sorry, there's nothing I can do. Best case scenario, I've got a, uh, a, you know, a refurbished model here at the shop, you're welcome to come in and look at that. I can get you that for about 500 bucks. I'm like, dude, I was supposed to get free batteries. That's not, a, that's not me paying for a new computer again. You remember I went through this before. Yeah, I remember, I don't know, it's just the way Scuba Pro is, I'm sorry, pal. And uh, so I finally go down to Seattle to look at this computer. Guess what? It's the same freaking model that I originally bought that the dive shop, that the, the scuba pro said they don't refurbish anymore. Well, guess what? This unit has been refurbished. You can see it's got scratches on it. It's even got dives still logged in it. And they're trying to sell it to me for 500 bucks. Can you believe that? It's crazy. I took pictures of this thing just so I had proof. Well, anyway, I said no way, and uh, I called the company direct. Uh, I get nothing, I get nothing, leave multiple messages. I finally call my attorneys and have my attorneys call them. Wow, guess what? Two hours later, I got a call back from the manager at Scuba Pro. Hey, I understand you're having a problem with your computer. What can I do for you? Oh, well, I give them the model number, they look it up. Yeah, I see here, you know, batteries for life. You're supposed to get back. Let me talk to my manager, I'll see what I can do. Two hours later, I get another call back. Well, you know, I see the best case scenario we can do is we can get you this, uh, you know, this other model and, uh, you know, and we'll ship it to, we'll ship it to you. And, and, uh, and he tells me how amazing it is. He goes through all the, the uh, incredible factors. It's their top of the line model. It's got a heart rate monitor. I'm sold. I'm like, okay, if you can give me that and we'll call it even. I said, I, you know, it's great. That's a good deal. So at the end of that conversation and all the perks, he says, oh, I'm sorry. We actually, you know, I don't have that model in stock. You know, I have, but I have this other model. It's, you know, it's the next model down. Uh, but it's still, it's still several models above the one you had. Okay, but you know, this is the one I have for you, so you gotta take that one. And I'm like, oh, come on, man. You just had me sold on the other one. I thought we had a deal. He's like, oh, I'm sorry. You know, this is... So I finally agree to that one. And he's like, okay, I'll ship it to the dive shop. And, and you know, if you wanna upgrade it and have that uh, heart rate monitor like the other one, then uh, you know you can do that at a later time. Of course, wow, later, little did I know it's a $250 upgrade. So um, I wait, I wait, I wait, I hear nothing. Two weeks later, I call the manager again, leave four messages, and finally get a hold of him again. <clears throat> He's like, hey, uh, what's the deal? I thought you got your computer. I'm like, no, I didn't get my computer. He's like, we send it to Seattle, you should have it. So he hangs up, he's like, I'll find out what happened. He calls Seattle and the dive shop sold the computer, the lower model. So now we're back to square one. 
And the guy says, basically, he's going to ship it directly to me. Once my address, he's going to ship it directly to me. So I asked him, I said, all right, can you, can, is there any way you can get me that original model that you convinced me I was going to be able to get, you know, the soul? And he's like, all right, I'll, I'll go ahead and get you the upgrade. I'll get you that model. All right? So this process started six months ago with this last model. And uh, as of today, here it is. It has officially arrived. That box is about to be open and I'm freaking excited about it. So I'm hoping that inside that box is what is promised to me, almost a $1,500 amazing top of the line, world renowned Scuba Pro Scuba Computer. So here we go. All right, so here we go, the official unboxing of the Scuba Pro Soul. Sort of feel like Christmas after six months of not having one, having my dive computer. So here we go. Inside the box, got Scuba Pro. What does it say? Except the partial. Inside one Galileo Soul. That's official. Boom! Scuba Pro! You attack. Here we go. Let's see what's looking like. Look at that. Pretty fancy. That's pretty nice. There's a disc in there and some more manual stuff down on the bottom. But this is a uh, Swiss engineer design says a uh, very nice freaking zipper case. Alright. Let's see what we got in here. Wow, oh, nice. Heart rate monitor included. Ah! And there we go. Look at that bad boy. Ha! Ah, that is no joke, man. This. Go like 300 feet, do nitrox diving, multiple air gas mixes, sensors on the top. Let's see if we can get it to light up. Ha! Ah. Welcome to you, Attack Scuba Pro Diving World with Galileo. Please personalize your Galileo in the next few steps. Thank you. Awesome. Well, there you go. I'm going to play with that a little bit. Check it out. See what that looks like. Man, that's pretty big. Business watch right there. Well, that's a much better buckle than on the last one. Last buckle eventually broke on me, in fact, when I sent it in. Just right about here. There it is. <clears throat> Boom! Now with a wetsuit under that, that's going to be perfect. And it will light up and uh, it has a blue illumination. Uh, probably when it's working at full. Anyway, that is it. End of story for now. Thanks for watching my video. Hope you like this. Please uh, like it and uh, subscribe to my channel. Have a great day, everybody.